Hi, I'm Dr. Mittner and I'm here at the Integrative Vet Med Center in Phoenix, Arizona. I specialize in Chinese medicine and acupuncture and I'm currently studying at the Qi Institute to get my master's degree in traditional Chinese medicine. Last time we talked about the theory of harmony in Chinese medicine of yin and yang. Today I'd like to introduce the five element theory. I'm going to be focusing on explaining the cycle of the five elements and then over the next few segments we'll talk about personality types and organ systems associated with each element. The five element theory further expands on the yin yang theory of harmony and balance that we talked about last time. Everything in life is classified into one of the five elements and they flow through a cycle as well as control each other. Today we're going to be talking about their cycle and flow. In Chinese medicine, as I previously mentioned, there are five elements. Wood, fire, earth, metal, and water. All things in life flow through this elemental cycle. The cycle begins with wood, which is associated with springtime, childhood, and new beginnings. Wood is a time of growth, and the emotion is anger, just like a child throwing a temper tantrum. The color for wood is green, and its direction is east. The flavor of foods associated with the wood element type are sour foods. During adolescence, we are ruled by fire, which is associated with the season of summer. Fire is emotion is joy. This tends to be a happy, carefree time for many people when life is ruled by passions and quick choices. Fire's color is red, its direction is south, and flavors of foods associated with fire are bitter foods. During middle age, we are more grounded, and earth rules this time of life. The season is late summer or harvest time, or Indian summer, and earth's emotion is worry. This is the time of life when people are settling down, building homes, and having children. Earth's direction is central. Its color is yellow, like that of the harvest grains, and its food is taste is sweet. Autumn or fall is the season ruled by metal. Metal is adulthood and associated with the emotion of grief or sadness. As we transition through this phase we see the passing of generations that have come before us and often look back with nostalgia on our own childhoods or see children that we've had reaching their own adulthood and moving out of the nest. Metal's color is white and the direction is west. The taste of food associated with the metal element is umami, which is savory or pungent foods. Fall gives way to winter, which is associated with the element of water. For many, this means piles of snow all around your house, but the actual color associated with the water element is black, like the deep, deep ocean. The food taste for water is salty, like the ocean, and the direction is north, like heading into new beginnings. This is associated with the senior time of our life, time where things have quieted down and we're reflecting back on things that have passed. The emotion associated with this element is fear, as often people are afraid of endings. But in Chinese medicine, we must remember that everything is a cycle, and water is needed to bring about new life and new growth, which brings us back to the wood element. Up next for our blog series, we're going to talk about each of the elements' personality types, so don't forget to check back for more videos.